Yo, what's good, guys? What's popping? Um, Vicky Melody here, and then they call me Playboy Sound and uh, Lamba. You get so, um, today I'm here with um, a quick one, uh, to show you um, some of the plugins that you can use to get clarity on your vocals. There are a lot of them, but I'm just going to be mentioning the few that I use. You get if, um, um at the cost of um, if I skip any that you know you use, you could also let me know on the comment section so I could look at this and try it for myself because we are all here to um impact and learn you, you guys i drop information then you also let me know the ones that you feel that i should know so i could also implement it in my mixes so this is vicky melody here so let's dive straight into the system and show you some of my plugins i use on my vocals all right so um i'll be previewing a song that i got featured on yeah the guy is um slumsy then um he I, I gave him a verse you get so I'm just going to play some sections of the of the song you get oh my baby get the fine shape oh I want that echo with the fine face you they make picky melody to one grace so one touch my baby you could want to so no darling I be sharp shooter my baby come close for my range over I could be your heart never make you change over yeah so that was my verse you get so I just did that and um in case you're wondering um i use my vocal mixing preset which is also on sale on this um platform so you could check the video on the card or you could contact me on whatsapp or instagram so i will will get it over to you so um the first let me just loop um this section then get my mixer up let me detach this guy so here is the vocal. Oh my baby get the fine shape. Oh. I need that echo with the fine f Yeah, so the first plugin I'll be talking about is Fresh Air from Slate Digital. This is like my current favorite right now. I use it now almost all the time in my vocal he gets. And there is um a tip, but I'm going to be letting you know um the tip after using most of this vocal um clarity plugin so this one is fresh air it has a lot of plugins and one of the best um plugins here is the vocal air or the presence pop you get or the vocal boss presence that's when you have um, a lot of um, vocals in a boss you could just use this to brighten them up you get but for me i like to do them manually you get you could this is the mid air and the high air so i'm going to like raise them so you see what they sound like Oh my baby get the fine shape oh. I want that echo with the fine face oh. You they make picky melody to one crazy so oh, one touch My baby you could bond to it so Tell your mama and your papa I won't take you to church I know be home myself cause I'm tempted to touch So you could also link both of them together and You know do that So One particular tip for using After using any of these plugins It's usually best to put a DSR after it you get the vocal will be bright but when it gets to the s's it takes them down so always use the dsr after using any of this kind of plugins so your your vocal don't get too painful in the ear because it saturates the high frequencies you get so it doesn't get so painful in the ear of the listener so that's for that if you've been following my channel over and you watch all my videos you always see me talk about vitamin this is one plugin that does everything you can use it for mastering you can use it for anything it works because it has five bands which represents almost the whole spectrum of your mix this is for your kick and your lows your mid range your mid your high mid and your um your high so uh, it works in anything you use it for so most of the time i use it in the vocal because it has this high um um vitamin on the on the high side most of the time i find myself tweaking this um high and um the mid most of the time i ignore the high mid and all these guys because that's where the vocal has the strength oh my baby get the fine shape oh. i want it that echo with the fine face oh. you they make picky melody to one crazy so oh, one touch my baby you could want to so oh. tell your mama and your papa i won't take you to church i know be home. so that's for that so the next plug in here is um the pure tech eq you should be familiar with this eq i use it all the time in my mastering yeah is the 
when i want to bring out the high um energy in my master but sometimes it works in the vocals too but most of the reason why i don't use it my main reason for not using it all the time in vocals is because the plugin has latency it, it has like a 2.9 milliseconds um, delay which is not noticeable but i i don't even like anything latency in my because i might add a plugin that has latency and add another one that might have 1.5 but by the time you are done with the chain you might be accumulating like a 10.0 latency which might not be heard but i don't like it so but it's also an option but i use it in my mastering because latency doesn't really matter there yeah so but why i like this particular one is once you select the 10 12 or 16k region and boost it it sounds beautiful you get Oh my baby get the fine shape oh. I want it that go with the fine face oh. You they make picky melody to one crazy so oh. one touch my baby you could on to it so But usually it's around the 10k and 12k that's where the sweetness of every vocal lies where the clarity you get the detail next plug in here <coughs> I don't know why I stopped using this plugin, but I used it a lot last year, but I've not used it before this year, but it's always on my list. Yeah, it's the um, the Scalp 73. It's just a general EQ for everything, but I just love the high. Yet it's, um, the high is just mostly on the 12K. That 12K is actually an important frequency. So it's actually on the 12K. So when I just boost it, you, it just gives that um energy we need at that 12k region oh my baby get the fine shape oh. i want it that go with the fine face oh. you they make picky melody to one crazy so oh, one touch my baby you could want to it so tell your mama and your papa i won't take you to church i know be home as time my baby no time oh yeah so you see it's almost the same thing they just do the same thing in different ways unique to them but i think out of all these plugins i'm mentioning the one that is the most powerful to me is vitamin you can never go wrong with vitamin some of these other plugins can get too extreme if you push them too much but vitamin i don't know that's for me though and uh, then this is the last one i use but i rarely use it but it's an option that's um the Afex vintage exciter is an you already know this plugin one of the first videos i ever did on this channel should be like five years ago that was what i was using then but it's still a valid plugin i actually don't like it that much but it works so if you want to get um good enough in this um plugin just don't cross the five um brain the mix of five don't even cross it just leave it between three and four is where you get your best results okay yeah, so those are the plugins so if you feel there are some plugins i didn't mention you could just let me know in the comments and if you also want uh me to mix or master any of your sound you get you can also hit me up my numbers are on the screen uh, my email should be there too and uh, my instagram everything should be there just let me know and um, you could also get in contact if you need any of our vocal mixing preset or our mastering preset anyone you need so just hit me up so i'll see you guys on the next one